Um, I've been in graduate school for six years. We haven't had a lot of money to put into the house. I still don't have a lot of money, but some things need to be done. Sure. What, what are you studying? Uh, education. Yeah? Yeah. Well, I retired from that about 10, 12 years ago. Really? I used to teach IT in the public school. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Okay. A long time ago in a different one. Pretty cool. But, uh, pretty cool. It's the greatest job working with children, and what drove me out was parents being crazy. Yeah. There's a lot of drama. Administration, parents, community. Yeah. And the one parent that says, I don't care what they do, I don't want to hear about it. Mm -hmm. You have them. Yeah. Or the other one is, is my child is destined for Yale Law. When you know they don't have the aptitude for it, mm -hmm. on board. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But uh, you mentioned the kitchen cabinet. Okay. And I was yeah. thinking, while we're in the kitchen, let me uh, let me see a little video. I like videos. I can look at it later, and we can study them, come up with good plans. Um, all right. You see, as we're rubbing on the green wall, and Kyle, that's a half. Our hinge is broken a little bit. I don't know if it'll fit back in, but um, it needs to be pulled out of your way. It needs to be pulled my way a little bit, but uh, there we go. That's it. All right, what else you got? Did you just lock it back into place? I'm not sure, but if we can call that done. <laughs> That's one on me. I've tried to put it back in, but I didn't do the, didn't do the extra tug. That's fine. Okay. And and please just monitor if it fails. Call okay. me. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay. My wife's dream is to get all these cabinets yeah. knocked out, countertops and cabinets. Okay. If we have extra time and you want to yeah. take some measurements and tell me how expensive it'll be, and I'll laugh. You know, we could. Cabinets. Are they expensive. All right. What kind of counters? I don't know. Lots of choices. Granite, Corian, granite's uh, budget $20 per square foot. Yeah. And you do your square foot calculations for a lap. Um, the Corian requires a special skill tool and talent, which we couldn't do, but hopefully we can put you in some good hands. Okay. So it turns out well. And cabinets go anywhere from reasonable to crazy. Yeah, well, I'm on the reasonable side. Yeah, and, and here again, if you can pick some things out, then we okay. can help with an install price. Okay. Okay. Screen, gonna, screen door. I'm going to leave your card. You'll have my contact information. Okay. <clears throat> and you can email me whatever you find. Oh my gosh. So, uh, looking at that gasket back here. I've had several kids, uh, friends of, the, of my kids, yeah. not see the screen and run through it. Yeah. And it's happened so many times. Actually, I had a guy last year do some work around the house. Yeah. He repainted it and rescreened it. Yeah. And I still got kids running through it. And it's just seen better days. I don't know if I need a whole new one. It won't stay on track. Um, it's just a piece of work. Um, yeah, let's, uh, let's look for a new screen door for Scott. Uh, replacement and see who's calling me. Mr. Kelly. My parents. <clears throat> my parents back in my day drew a uh, target. Spray painted a target. <laughs> so the next thing you know you can still see through it but you will see uh, like a red or yeah. whatever. That's smart. Okay. My kids have never done it but other kids can murder me like <laughs> just like plow right through it and yeah. stand right out here and I'm like, yeah. okay, tell me about it. Oh. <laughs> okay, a big one, I mean, we can save it to the end because it's wet outside. Yeah. Um, I need to get the house painted. Okay. And I think there's a lot of work that needs to be done on replacing some wood mm -hmm. and whatnot. Like, uh, uh, the cracks kind of scare me a little bit. I hope not too much moisture has gotten um, in places and there's stuff all around the house. So one thing Kyle is seeing that I've looked at a little bit is it, it looks like swelling. Yeah, I was going to say it's already been eaten up. But we'll do a lap and let's take a look. Can you get the far left side of that chimney? Yeah, it's on the back side the run and the front side 
And the neat thing we can do now in 2013 is replace it with something that can't rot. Okay. And we can also replace it with a caulk that they tell us it has a lifetime warranty. I've not seen it fail. So uh, let's uh, let's make some good choices. Okay. Um, another easy one is the screens under here. I have a screen that's missing here. Okay. It gets blown out when we get wind. Actually, the wind last night blew these chairs across. Yeah. It always blows it out, and the last time it bent it. Yeah. And so I need a, a screen replaced. Okay. Here. Okay. What we do is uh, we buy channel, and we actually make those. Um, if you can see the corners of this one, it's a little bit changed in color, and those are little plastic elbows. And we cut the metal to size. It's got a, um, a little groove in it where we lay the screen, put the spline, roll it in. We can cut them any size. Okay. Mm -hmm. No. Good. So maybe we can. My yeah. daughter doesn't open her window because that, that screen is uh, ripped. Ripped. Yeah. And maybe we can just get that one replaced. Yeah. And what we do in the case is, uh, we we could um, let's see what kind of screen it is. Yeah, similar thing. And we'll take the screen out of the existing metal housing and put a new screen in. All right. Another easy one is. Um, my kids used to use the fence as a soccer goal. Oh yeah. And so I may have snapped them. I have pieced them together. Okay. Broken pieces and hammered them back in just so the dog wouldn't escape. Okay. Um, it has some life left in it, so I just like some of the uh, boards that are broken in place. Scott, it would have a lot of life if a couple of things. Um, one is that we would need to pressure clean your house before painting. And if we could pressure clean this as well, and both sides of the fence, and I I don't know if you would like to enlist some helpers, which they can or we can, remove all the foliage growing be yeah. between the slats, and let's get a coat of um, really any kind of sealant, any color, especially at the bottom where it intersects with the ground, and and we have found that. If we can do that to a fence that we build, we give actual lifetime warranties on our exterior builds. Okay. So you could expect an extraordinary life out of something you take care of outside, even if it is outside if you take care of it. Um, maybe you know the limbs over this thing, we can kind of hack them back a little bit if we're allowed to do that. Oh, yeah. So. Uh, I think I did it five or six years ago and it's so kind of creeped back in. Okay. But yeah, that, that's definitely something we can help with. Oh, um, well, we can look at it when we walk around the house. Okay. There's a crawl space door right there. Yeah. And it's just, uh, or you can walk down the stairs, I guess, and look at it. I think mm -hmm. it wasn't built, built well the first time. The hinges are like too big. Sure. And the wood has fallen off the frame. Uh, it's fallen off the top before as well. I hammered it back in. Okay. I think it could be uh, shaped up a little bit. And that top, uh, what do you ever call that siding piece? I had to hammer that back in. Actually, the top two siding pieces. You know, the gray ones. Yeah, those two. Yeah. So I've had to rip put those back in. Okay. Let's get a measurement of the hole. That's running, what is it, 37, almost, yeah, almost, at least on the top of it, and the door is going, grab that OSB bottom, to 66 and a half, if I can see that on my tape, okay, let's take a peek inside real quick, ah, uh, A um, couple things. Um, being in 5x OSB, usually that's all we have, and the trim board is it's it's not heavy. Um, that's basically stabilizing the door to hold it up. But then adding the hardy, it it starts to apply lots and lots of weight to it. It is screwed into a trim board, which is asking an awful lot of the trim board. 
the hinges are actually not lining up real well or the door has warped it's probably a lot of both the separation at the top of this corner and uh it's, it's pretty much flush here and then not down there okay so that's that's a that was just an adjustment but um it's a really nice tube of six what's behind this tube of six um a couple of two by fours so there's enough beef here to hold a door like that um but i would go to three hinges yeah. three four inch hinges without a question and i think that you'll have something stands the test of time that's looks a like pretty has, cross space it looks like it had three one five one time i don't I usually also wonder if they had the hinges on this side at one point too <laughs> yeah see that yeah. switched it and that's it's it's, it's, yeah, it's kind of twisted right as it goes up but, uh, had to switch sides before. yeah but um yeah these doors are a little tricky to build what we could do is that's called cedar mill because it's not beaded and it looks like wood and you would want another one that looks like this okay let's see if we can put them back in what you call the siding stuff cedar mill yeah, if you go into Home Depot and you say I want some cedar mill siding, they'll point you at this. I thought it was like concrete. Well, the the con it is a concrete fiberboard. Yeah. Um, the concrete fiberboard comes in lots of flavors, and this flavor cedar mill. They make uh, what they call smooth beaded, the cedar mill, um, and and the cedar mill beaded, which is it's got a little bead on the bottom. Okay. So, okay. Ah. Uh. I'm not a big fan of this tree because it like litters the yard with uh, surfaces yeah. all the time. My wife loves the shade, but um, the yeah. Well, it's striking the house is a bad thing. Yeah. So I have trimmed it twice now, and this is the new growth. I trimmed it last year, so I can I can take care of that. Sure. Good. Okay. Yo. Know, few things I can do around here. What What we see, what we see is that. Uh, <clears throat> limbs that are left hitting yeah over a long period of time actually uh, removes the siding yeah where's holding it hmm.